Hello, this is Miss Janet with JLS Success Central and welcome to my channel. We provide you with up-to-date information to help you build your business and personal credit as well as your business and personal finances. Now tonight's video is about business finances. That's right, business finances. And before I get started, I just want to say Miss Janet wants you to win. Miss Janet wants your 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 uh, business venture, your business endeavors to be successful. Miss Janet wants your multiple streams of income to be successful. But it's very important that you build a foundation, build a solid foundation, so that your business can grow brick by brick by brick, brick by brick by brick. That means you need to be a legal entity, not a sole proprietorship, but a legal entity. That is an S Corp, a C Corp, or an LLC, or whatever you and your accountant or attorney deem is appropriate for your business venture slash ventures. So uh, it's important that you have this, uh, legal, be a legal entity. It's important that you have an EIN number. It's important that you have a business bank account. It's important you don't want to commingle funds with your personal account. It's important that you have a um, a um, a business address, a brick and mortar address, not a UPS or a mailbox address, not your nana's house, not mama's house, not even your house. You want to make sure it's a business a business address. You also want to make sure that you have an 800 number and it's listed with 411. You want to register with Dan and Bradstreet. You want to register with um, Experian Business and Equifax Business. You want to build at least three to five lines of credit. Have them reporting no, no PG, no personal guarantee credit, reporting to the uh, credit, the business credit bureaus, especially Dun & Bradstreet. You definitely want to make sure that you're on their radar. And in a few months before you know it, if you've done everything step by step, brick by brick, before you know it, you will be qualified to get hundreds of thousands of dollars in funding that you can use to, or that you can leverage uh, to purchase real estate, to purchase notes or just build an empire for your children, children's children, and so on and so forth. So it's, it's more to it than that, but that's just the foundation. So you just want to make sure that you do everything decent and in order, okay? Well, you know what? I'm going to talk about money tonight. Free money, free money, free money. And I did a video earlier about NAV's quarterly Grants. Now, free money is grants, not the loan. They are grants. And, you know, I know we're on the grind. We're making our, we're, we're closing our deals. We're, you know, we're getting clientele and we're doing, we're just working. And we're waiting for the EIDL. <laughs> we're waiting for the EIDL increase. I know a lot of us got the EIDL last year, and some people got the PPP last year and got PPP this year. But right now, we're waiting on that EIDL increase. Now, even though you're you're, you're on the grind and you're building your your business, you're building your empire, you're doing everything decent in order. You know what? And you're waiting on that EIDL <laughs> increase if you apply. But there's free money out there. And you know what? You want to always be looking for free money for your business. Look, I applied to, I, 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 I entered, I applied for 20 different grants over the last nine months. And I got two. I got an LISC grant through the County of Los Angeles. And I got a um, Lindustry grant through the state of California. So that was $10,000 over the last nine months, additional, in addition to what I already, what I was making with my clients and what I got from SBA or whatever the case may be. Always be looking for money, always, but you can't get it unless you apply. And these private grants, they're very competitive. You know, you don't just meet the requirements and you get paid, no, 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 no. There's Thousands of people applying for these grants at the same time you are. And so you got to stand out from, from the crowd, you know. So um, 
I'll touch base on that in a few minutes. Here, here's the application. This is, oh, hold on now, hold on, Janet. Stacy's Rise Project. And the application is now open, and you can receive uh, $10,000 and a mentorship. Now, let me get right down here really quick. I told you you're going to receive a mentorship, but look at this. Our, fin our financial support will award 10,000 grants to 10 small businesses, 10 small business owners. Hey, might as well be you. I'm going to try to make it me. I'm definitely going to apply. You can't get it if you do not apply. Okay? Now, I hope I'm looking in the camera. I keep looking at myself. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm going to put the link to this in my... Um, Description below, but look at here. The application opened May 7, 2021 and closed on July 9, 2021 at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So pay, pay attention to your time zone and make sure you get it in in time if you're, you know, up against the clock. Now, here's the eligibility. You have uh, between 25000 and no more than a million dollars in annual sales. So you made at least $25,000, okay? This, you know, uh, I guess this past year or last. I don't know, but you made at least $25,000 in sales. You participate in the virtual mentorship program, and you can't be a part of any other accelerated program. So I'm going to put this link in my uh, description below so you guys can check it out. And hey. If you like this type of content, press the like button and leave me a comment. And if you're not a subscriber thus far, please subscribe at this time. And I want to take this opportunity to thank all of you who have shared my videos, who visit, who stop by and visit Miss Janet, who have subscribed and helping me build this channel. Hey, see you in a couple of days. Grace and peace. Miss Janet out.